Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's me, Tyra. If you're new here, hi, hello. And if you're not new here, welcome back. I'm so freaking excited today. It is the start of our wedding weekend. Today is Wednesday. Today is the day that we leave to go to our wedding. Our wedding is actually three hours away from us. We live in Austin, Texas, but our wedding is in Dallas. So our wedding is on Saturday, but we leave out today. Last night, you guys saw that my fiance and I went to go pick up our rental truck um, because it's a lot that we're bringing out there. Like it's our wedding, so there's lots of wedding decor, bridesmaids and girls in boxes, my big old dress, his tuxedo or his suit, our suitcases, hygiene bags, like it's so much that we're bringing, so we just had to get a rental truck. Um, and you guys got to see that last night, but we're heading to my nail appointment this morning. We're getting the purple off, but just know we're running it back after the wedding because I freaking love the chrome. Obviously, I'm not going to do purple again. We're going to do something else, but I love the freaking chrome so much. But we're heading out. My nail appointment is at 10 a.m. this morning, and these are it's going to be my wedding nails, which I'm going to let you guys see. So freaking excited. I'm kind of out of breath because I'm just so excited. I cannot believe my wedding weekend is literally here. Like, I remember a whole year ago when we've been planning this wedding for literally a year straight. And now it's finally here. I'm so excited. So this vlog is going to consist of me trying to get as many behind the scenes as possible for our wedding. I told myself that I was going to really try and dedicate my time to giving you guys as much footage as possible um, for the wedding because I know how people say like I'm going to vlog this weekend and this and that, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that, but like you don't do it. But I really, really, really want to be intentional about trying my absolute hardest to pick up the camera and just film something each day. Um, leading up to the wedding, even at the wedding, I want to give you guys behind the scenes footage of me, like just in the bridal suite, getting my makeup done, like literally at my wedding. So you guys are going to be with me the whole weekend, the whole freaking weekend. And I'm going to dedicate my time to really try my best to really try to get you guys as much footage as possible. Even when I don't even feel like picking up the camera, I'm going to do it. I'm also going to be filming as much as possible for my, um, TikTok and Instagram. So if you guys don't see it on here, of course, you can always follow me on my Instagram and TikTok here if you like to get more behind the scenes um, on Reels or TikTok. And right after our nail appointment, we're heading straight out to Dallas because everything's packed. So we're heading straight out to Dallas. I'm super, super, super excited. So like I said, even if I'm not talking to you guys head on like this, I'm still going to try to pick up the camera just to show you what I'm doing. So yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video so much of course don't forget to like comment subscribe don't forget to tell a friend tell a friend tell a friend i will see you guys for the wedding weekend you guys i had to mute these clips because there was music playing in the background but this is the before you guys we made it to my nail shop we're about to get my nails done so let's go i'm literally sitting here and waiting to get my nails and toes done so this is the before I'm getting a pedicure today as well. I haven't had a pedicure in such a long time, so I'm so excited for it because my feet is in dire need of one. And of course y'all know I'm a friendship girl, so getting friendship on toes, but just waiting to get seated. It's always something. I feel like especially with wedding stuff, my normal nail tech is not here today, so we're using some money. Hi. Um, I'm doing French tip, white French tip. My normal nail tech is not here today. And I'm kind of irritated, but we're just gonna give it to God. Let him to control, I'm not gonna get too upset. And just move on like normal.
Okay, guys, so again, I had to mute it because the music is just music in the background. But I wanted to show you guys different bases that my nail tech put out for me to pick from for my French chip. I'm very particular about my French chip and the bases that I use for different occasions. And I feel like for my wedding, I didn't want to go too nude, but I did not want to go too pink. So I think the nude pinkish color that you will see, it's actually that one, the one he's having his in right now. That one is going to be the one that I go with. the nails and toes are done we're about to head and get something quick to eat and then head to Dallas. Oh. okay we're about to get something really quick to eat and then we're gonna head to Dallas I'm thinking we're getting like something simple like a Jimmy John sandwich and some chips and we're gonna be good to go so I'll see you guys when we get our food you guys we are at Circle K and we're getting some chips to eat with our sandwiches. I think I'm not really feeling anything hot to be honest. So I think I'm just gonna get these. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get these and a drink. Guys, I'm literally so excited to eat. I'm so hungry. We was at that Nell appointment for, we got there at like 10, 20-ish, and we're walking out at like one something. Did you so. walk or something? Yes, I did YouTube. <laughs> yeah, thing. guys we literally just made it to our hotel for the weekend it's so beautiful i'm so excited i feel such like a luxurious girl right now because the hotel chef's kiss is that him yeah that's him um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and start getting out and bringing things into our hotel room I'll show you guys a tour of our hotel room. So my camera's also about to die. So I'll, I'll see you guys soon Okay, guys, so I'm doing a room tour of our wedding room obviously when You walk in this is the door you walk in This is like a table and some chairs. They have a little kitchen little area to sit down and eat so cute and then they have another table for stuff, a living little space here, couches, TV. They have this outside, which is so pretty, so freaking pretty. The view is so pretty. Like it's lit. And then we have another room. This is where Corey and I will be. Duh. And then we have a balcony, which I don't really feel, I'm not a big balcony person, but you can definitely open it and go out. Oh, I can't even like. Okay. And then table, da da da. 
bathroom. Oh, so pretty! So pretty, y'all. So pretty. You guys, it is now currently 7.48 and we've been in the hotel for about an hour or so. <sighs> y'all, I'm so happy to be there. Like, this is just like a perfect start for our wedding weekend. Um, right now, I just finished up some partnership stuff that I needed to get together before I kind of cut off my iPad for the weekend. But I have a very special content I started a very special collab coming with a jewelry brand. This is going to be my first time working with a jewelry brand. And I'm so excited for it because it's going to definitely elevate my look as a wife. I am so excited because my friend Faith actually is the one who put the idea in my head to like start elevating the look as a wife. I'll link her down below. I'll put her on the screen. So if you want to go and watch her video regarding the elevating the look, etc., Go click our video to watch it. I'm gonna show you guys some cookies that we got made for our bridal boxes last week. They're so super, super, super cute. I'm gonna show you guys real quick. These are the cookies. It says Booker's 2024. And when I tell you they're so freaking cute, I haven't even tried one yet, but Corey ate one. He said they were really good. Um, I put one in all of my bridal part party boxes. So I'll let somebody taste test one on camera later. Like when I see more people and I'll let you know what to think. But I think they're really cute. I'll probably see you guys tomorrow. There's not really much else that's going to go on today. But just kind of relaxing and getting settled in to our wedding hotel. And I'll see you guys soon. Hey guys. It is currently 4 something in, or 3 something in the morning. Um, it's Thursday. And I'm talking a little because obviously Corey's asleep. I don't even know why I'm up because I don't even wake up th during this time. But I think I'm just like, I can't sleep just cause it's my wedding weekend and my mind is constantly racing and I don't know. We did kind of go to sleep a little early, but like for me, that would be normal. I've been doing more content stuff. Today I have to get my hair done at 9 a.m. So. But I just want to check in with you guys. I'm going to like finish what I'm doing and probably get back in bed. And then I'm going to wake up at 7 to shower. And I know Corey wanted to wake up to go eat breakfast at the in the hotel lobby. And then we got some wedding business to handle. And then I'm going to go get my hair done. So see you guys soon. It's now 6.30 in the morning. I am up again. I did go to sleep for a little while. Because I think the last time I talked to you guys, it was like four something. So I went to sleep for a little while. It's 6.30 now. We have to get up at 7. So I guess it's okay to be up now because we have to get up anyways very soon. What's crazy is I literally woke up and detangled all these bundles as best as possible. And it took me like an hour. And I'm like, this is what I should have been doing when I was up at 2 a.m., 3 a.m. Like I could have been doing this. But I waited last minute to do this. And now the bundles are super wet, but like I didn't want to bring them to her super tangled because I'm like, that's kind of, it's just not ethical. So I was like, let me just try to fix these up as best as possible so she can have an easier time, you know, with the application process. But yeah, so let's go ahead and go. I'll see you when I get to my hair appointment. It's the weed, mm -hmm. like I can't, I just, I was like, I can't do this. Like, um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you take that dove? Wait for my area shampoo because <laughs> for the last like two weeks, I didn't want to. But now that I see you can say. Bridal party is staying. We're all staying. We'll take them all for the right price. We get the deals, you get the good stuff. Just done like at everybody's house. Like where you live, we just pick like the corner that can be filmed because you know what I mean? Ernestine's office is at her office at the Legacy Center, so it's not like we're. Because he's like, he, they figured out a, a flow, they figured out a vibe. Mm -hmm. It's outrage to get this three minute skit. It has to be three minutes, right? To get started. And also, you meet peers. These are the people who are on your TacticalCEO.com, BeMorningMeetup.com. It is time for you to grow and be part of our family. Just throw it over there. Both of them. <laughs> <laughs>
And uh, so, I mean, we're talking like amazing. I'm like, at least she <laughs> knows this, at least thing. <laughs> right? And uh, so, I really have a plan. Um, we're in survival mode. And, you know, when you're in survival mode as an entrepreneur, it's not a good thing. It, it's, it's a good thing temporarily, but it's not a good thing long term. Um, because Period. we were just building out a necessity Period. rather than I wish I liked this. We've been tired of going from contract to contract or this is how it's gonna be. There's gonna be a police. Guys, we are all done. We are done, 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 done. I love it so much. You have to trust the process. It might look a little funny to you, but you literally have to trust the process. Like it's gonna come together the day or what. It's gonna come together. And I'm so excited. Hey guys, so I literally am out. Why is this show like that? Okay. Hey guys, so I'm literally out the hair salon and I am heading back to the hotel to grab my scarf because I have to lay my hair down because, like, this is my natural hair out and it needs to be flat, honey. So I'm about to have my scarf on for the next, like, day because tomorrow's Friday. So up until Saturday, I have to keep a scarf on. Which is fine with me because that's why I bought them. But heading to the hotel to get my scarf and then we're gonna head to go get the alcohol for the wedding. And then we're heading to get my ring clean for the wedding. And I think, mm, nah. I was gonna say I was gonna get it clean and take it off and not wear it until Saturday. But nah, it's not that serious. My stylist told me that I definitely gave her a challenge with this hairstyle because she's never done anything like this before, but she loved it and like she's always down for a good challenge. So it's always me that's like coming up with something new, something fun, something different. Like I'm always doing something different, which I love it for me. Okay y'all, so we're back. The ring is clean. My hands are ashy. Ring is cleaned. Now we're heading to get the alcohol. And after that, we're done with our errands for today. Let me check the calendar. Yeah, we're done with the errands for today. And then tomorrow, we have our rehearsal and rehearsal dinner and we have to get actually we already got that so never mind but yeah now we're just chilling y'all so I'll let you guys obviously follow along for the rest of the day to see what we're doing but we're pretty much done with all things wedding planning wise like everything that we like Aaron wise now it literally game time tomorrow because it's the rehearsal dinner the rehearsal so that's when the festivities begin but yeah. so far I can say I've had a blessed stress-free wedding weekend so far and I'm glad that I haven't had any like I haven't ran into any issues like most brides do God is really on my side Yeah, I'm kind of feeling myself a little bit just because like, I don't know, this this go around with this um, curly hair eats a little different than the last time. I like it a lot more than I did last time. So I'm kind of feeling myself. Here's Corey. Y'all haven't seen him today. Bae said, hey. He got a little attitude or whatever. But you know. Anyways, I'll catch you guys back up when we're actually doing something worth filming. See you soon. We're in sex, guys.
you guys so i literally just finished my makeup look for today i had to film some content for a very love beloved friend that we all know and love and care about if you are into makeup it's uh i can give you a hint though um it is but it's, well you know what i'm gonna tell you guys because by the time this is posted that would have been posted so it was i filmed a collaboration with real techniques and when I tell you I loved it, I had to do the two-in-one miracle sponge. I just wanted to come on camera to show you guys, but I'm going now. I'm going to take the makeup off and go bye. Bye-bye, bye-bye, bye, bye, bye. Hey, guys. So, it is now currently 5.52, and it's time to start on Corey's hair because... Obviously, I'm doing his hair for the wedding. If you guys have seen this video here, I'm going to put it on the screen. That's the same products that I'm going to be using today on his hair. You guys saw that I posted a, a routine of what I use on his hair for the wedding. And we're about to execute that stuff that we saw at home. What I did at home today. This time, the only thing that's different is that I don't have my hooded dryer with me. By the way, my hairstylist have the same hooded dryer I have. I think it's a hair It is. It's a professional hair dry, hair stylish hoodie dryer. I don't have my hoodie dryer with me, obviously, but I did bring my Timo. But we're going to take my time. I bought everything I need. I have my spray bottle filled with water, some leave-in spray, my two stylers, my three-row combs. So we got to get to work. I did bring gloves because I didn't want to get, like, products all throughout my, you know, fresh manicure and nails. So we're gonna go ahead and pop these bad boys on. I brought him a microfiber towel so his hair is not dripping everywhere when he got the shower. And we're about to go ahead and get started. You did bring your bun and everything, right? Of course you do. So I literally just got done with Corey's hair. I am now just sitting here chilling out He went to go see his mom downstairs because she just made it into the hotel with her significant other I'm not going yet because I just need to get myself together. Okay Um, Just need to chill a little bit But there's not really much going on right now besides me finishing his hair. I'll probably go down to see his mom soon it's currently 705 so yeah I will check back in with y'all if we're doing something worth filming or I'll see you tomorrow. See you soon. Good morning. Good freaking morning. Okay, but the glow though, can we talk about the glow? So, I literally just woke up. It is like... 7.32 in the morning. If you guys are wondering if I got up super early again this morning, I woke up at 3 something, but I didn't get out of bed. I just I woke up and then went right back to sleep. Like I just turned my head and closed my eyes and went back to sleep. And then woke up again at 6, I think. Maybe. I don't know but it's time to get up now it's seven something baby went down there for breakfast um i again don't feel like eating anything i did something different to my curls last night i actually like bought some mousse and like defined my curls a little bit and then i diffused my curls so i'm liking this a lot more like yeah Today is a special day. <laughs> Today is a special day. Today is the rehearsal dinner. Today is the rehearsal. Today is when all the guests get, well, like, 90% of the guests arrive today. A lot of them are staying at different hotels, but a lot of them are staying here. 
I'll check back in with you guys after I do skincare and like do some hygiene stuff. And yeah, I will check back in with you guys later. Rose smell like. That's a beautiful smell. There we go. So I was like, what the heck? It took forever to um, focus. But we are now heading, leaving the hotel to go get. Can you hold this for a second? And let me, I need to, because I'm tired of this thing with them. Oh, that. How do you fix that? Um, No, it's not bro, it's just always um like kind of loose. You gotta just hold this. Let me stop recording for a second. Okay, I'm back y'all. So we are heading to the store because as I told you guys earlier, we can't get a pick for Corey's hair. Let's go. Hey you guys, oh my gosh, I'm so blurry. Focus, 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 focus. Focus. Hi guys, hi. Um, so, it's now three something. As you can see, my makeup's done. I have on the same fit I was having on earlier. Makeup's done, I'm just really chilling. We're about to go to our um, rehearsal soon. At 4 p.m., a lot of people have showed up. I haven't updated you guys in a while because, like, we literally have kind of been moving around a little bit. But I just wanted to check in and let you guys know that everything's going fine. 4 p.m. is the rehearsal. My makeup's done. This is what I'm wearing to rehearsal. And then I'm going to come back and change it to my outfit for the dinner. And then after that, we're going to come back to the hotel and turn up. Bye soon. You guys, he's leaving me for the night because he can't see me after 12. <sighs> I'm so sad because I haven't slept without my man in years. Uh, we literally don't sleep a day apart ever. So it's just one night. I can do it. Bye, babe. Okay. Okay. Okay, you guys, I have a little time to talk. I am back from the rehearsal, rehearsal dinner. I know I look super crazy, I look bald headed, but that's just cause my bun is like slid back really, really far. And my forehead is protruding. <laughs> but anyways, um, yeah, so that went all okay. That's all I'm gonna say. Um, I am going to, I'm going, my, my maid of honor is on her way to my room now since the room is to myself now, pretty much. And I'm going to go ahead and get finished myself together, take my makeup off, and then we're gonna be hanging out downstairs for a little bit, a little bit, I think. But yeah, there's not really much, I'm not gonna come back to the camera tonight, I just can't. I'm kinda like a little bit overwhelmed, just a little bit, just a little bit, so yeah. I'll see you guys tomorrow, hopefully. Hey guys, so my sister Andrea, not Andrea, the Adria, my bad. I'll zoom in, let me zoom out. Oh, hold on. My Real cute, real cute, real cute. Hello, hello. Real, real sleek, real sleek. Mm. Real cute. <laughs> My sis, Theadra, is going to ask me interview questions, which I think this will be perfect to put into the YouTube vlog, anyways. So I'm gonna zoom in on me, and she's gonna ask random questions. So, question number one mm -hmm. How does he make you feel? Corey makes me feel like the most seen and happiest person in the world and are these short answers like just short like straight to the point since there are questions however you want to ask me yeah i do short answers since they're like how many questions you got i see how many more questions you got i only got one more what? three okay um he makes me feel like the most seen and happiest person in the world and he makes me feel like i'm the most important person in his life as i should be as he period, should. period. Your um, wifey, like, whenever you took wifey role, mm -hmm. you became number one, mm -hmm. like, in his life. Right. That's what his commitment, you know. Mm -hmm. Under you, God as a union yeah. is. Mm -hmm. 
He's your. He's supposed to lead you. Right. And he can't lead you if he put others above, above you. You never right. know which path he's taking if there's so many people in your way. Exactly. Exactly. So as he should. As he should. I'm proud of that boy. <laughs> What they say there, my man, my man, my man. Period. So, what are some like little things that he do that makes you feel loved? Like things that mm. you just wouldn't, you know, that he wouldn't. Like the littlest thing. Little things, like the smallest thing. Okay. Um. One that comes right off the head is I'll be asleep, but I can hear him go plugging my phones out. I'm I'm quick when my phone down. And it, like every night he'll just go plug it up for me on the side of my bed. Aww. That's that's small, but I know I hear it every night. I don't say nothing because you're like, you know how you don't want to bring you up something like, yeah. you know when you tell somebody something they do, they're like, okay, I'm not doing it no more because you're talking about it. <laughs> I never right. say anything, but like, I hear it every time he'll just go plug it up and like, you know you that thing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yep. that's sweet. Yep. I raised him right. No, like, <laughs> Kim, you did a good job. Hello, 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 hello. So, if you were to be in a private conversation with your first, like your kids, and they want to ask, like, how was daddy before we came along, what would you tell them? Ooh, I would they were made a thank you. <laughs> no, because I'm trying to find the right words for that. Um, I would probably say he's the most caring and genuine person you'll ever meet. Because okay. he, tr Corey truly cares about people. Like, I don't think he has a bad bone in his body to hurt, like, intentionally hurt somebody. Like, right. he's always trying to find a way to improve. Exactly. Even with somebody he barely knows, he'll try to do something to help them. Like, he's never. He's not selfish at all. He's very selfless. That's the perfect. He's a very selfless person. Selfless. That's the word I would use for him. <laughs> is there anything what? you want to just throw out right there? I'm going to actually edit this and put it in a video. Is there anything you want to throw out right there? Right. Babe, I just want to say that I love you so much. Cause I know you're going to watch this because you watch all my videos on TV. <laughs> and post and share them. Cause you just did exactly, exactly. that guy. <laughs> um, I love you so much, and I cannot wait to marry you today. It's currently 1:57 in the morning. Me and Theodra are literally sitting here in a room chilling while you downstairs talking. But we love you. <laughs> <laughs> and we just up and edit, but I'll see you in. And we got so much energy, like yeah, we do. We really like do. for me to be for me to be running out three hours of sleep, mm -hmm. I have so much energy right now. Three hours of sleep. Girl, I told you I woke for the kids. I woke up though. I woke up at seven. Mm, I don't know. I guess it didn't register when you were saying all that. So you sleepy. You tired. Not right. I got my moo moo on. I'm so happy. Period. <laughs> Look at her. Oh, so my moo moo got pockets. <laughs> I love that for you. Uh, I, was, I, I love my moo moo in pockets. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> Oh, oh. Hold on. Hello? Hey, don't open, don't open the door. Oh, no. Can I come out there, though, brother? I know she came, but can I? No. Oh, yeah, you can, but I'm not at the door, so. Okay, go over there. Go away. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Can you, tell, can you tell her to give me uh, okay, I got it. that other room key? Because I got to check out and then check back in. Hey. Hey, uh, Tara, can we get that other, you know where that other room key at? The one he gave us last night? Yeah, it's so many keys. I don't know where this one. Oh, one of hers. How you doing? Sweating day. Yeah. You got that big Kool-Aid smile. I'm proud of you. <laughs> So, how does Tyra make you feel? Uh, she makes me feel happy and not alone, most importantly. So I learned yesterday, standing in a room by myself, I was bored. <laughs> like, so, like, you know that Will Smith, that Will Smith scene? Like, that Will Smith scene when he was like, just standing around in a room. Mm -hmm. I was literally just sitting on the couch. Like, what around. to do? No TV on. I was like, man, I'm bored. <laughs> it was quiet. It was, so, I kind of made me realize that. So, what are little things that she do that makes you feel loved? Like, it could be the smallest of things. Um, I would say, 
like when she wakes up in the morning, or she wake up before me. So like she always makes sure like the house is clean. And she sit on my work stuff. Oh, that's so morning, cute. I love that. Put my laptop out so I can just wake up and turn get it straight on. to it, huh? I know that's right. And in the future, when y'all have some little children and they ask you like in a private setting with you and just your kids, how was mommy before I came? What would you tell them? Um, how was mommy before I came? Mm -hmm. Like how was she, how was she to you before I was even thought of? She, I would say that she's always been a caregiver. So like, it's like she was born so She's very nurturing, sure. huh? Yeah, oh, nurturing. that's so sweet. So, like, before you, you getting, you know, little kids, they gonna be all the nurturing and love. Of course, they're kids, but I was getting the same thing before you was in the house, so it's kind of like coming to the world already. Yeah. Like a good parent so, what made you sure that Tara was it for you? Like, I know you've been, like, yeah, I've been together this long, so I knew you knew something uh, ahead of time, but, like, what made you sure that, like, this is what you want to do? Because, like, she, like, from the beginning, she always, like, made it clear that, like, we was a team, and oh. she always, she had my back when I was broke. <laughs> when I was <laughs> broke so before, before I got that job and moved out here, man, me and her, we'll just tag team, like, we'll still, like, split the bill, she get it, I get it one day, like, you just, like, it was, like, ultimate team version, and on top of that, uh, she also built my relationship with, she helped my relationship with God, like, oh. with God, so. I love that. You ain't getting cold feet, that's what you should say. You ready, them feet warm, ready, hot and ready, like yeah, little season. It's cold, but, uh. Your feet ain't cold, huh? <laughs> <laughs> How I turn this thing off, brother? Oh, I don't want to oh. mess it up. Wedding day! <laughs> Let's see your hair. Okay, okay, okay. Period. Uh, I'm just a little ashy, baby. <laughs> First step, you. Come on, content. I'm trying to do better in 2024. I know Tara probably put a bouquet in my hands instead of this check this. <laughs> <laughs> in between, I'll take care of it. Okay, this might. This might. You don't put your scarf immediately on it, just start molding it? No? No, because I gotta make sure it. It's a it's certain steady. level of movement that I allow before I put that scarf in. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to make sure, because earlier it was still crinkling up. Mm -hmm. I'm, sure. I'm not gonna lie, when I see crinkles a little bit, it's kind of cute. Like when you get like that natural wave, right? No, no. Okay. Like the crinkles that was that was on my head. Mm. But that's what you're saying. I think it looks good. It looks good. Thanks. Thank you for all oh, your little baby hairs. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ashley, it's okay, Ashley, it's okay. <laughs> just a little spray. I know, I just did it. It was really cold. <laughs> <laughs> Are you nervous? A little bit. Mm -mm, okay, it's fine, it's fine. It's all good. I just feel like, because I don't wear makeup, I'm going to like, crash my face or
Hey guys, we're on our way to the venue. I'm super excited. Say hey, Ashley. We got my glasses out for everybody. Oh, Ashley? Yes. I'm putting your foot back on. Oh, no, no, you're fine. Okay. And I love this mirror, guys. It's so huge. So cute. Oh, you're good. Dress for shoes. You get this. It's not my hair. The bridal suite is so nice. Oh, okay. Hello, I'm the next upcoming <laughs> star to be canceled. Canceled? You want to be canceled last night? That's what you said last night. Oh. You know the most canceled people be having all kind of money yeah. when they get canceled. But the goal is not to be canceled, Theater. I don't want to be canceled, but they already canceled me. So Can you see the clip? No, I need to fix it. Pen. The clip. I mean the bobby pin. Definitely. Uh, I need to fix it. It needs to be from, more like. Not from this few, like. I think she said definitely. <laughs> so I thought that was supposed to go more so like inside the hair, where it's like it'll yeah, you push it through. Like it just has through. to hold that thing down. That's the only thing. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna test out. try for you. I need a black one. Oh, oh that? That? Go pick this up. Nerves getting big. Nerves. Well, I need to nervous. Oh, to fix. Yeah, I'm probably wondering why I'm getting nervous. We're not. Because it's my baby brother. You don't go. I might. Yeah, I ain't never seen the room. Alright. Nah. Y'all probably need one bobby pin just to yeah, hold the flap. Definitely yeah, I have heard of a river of quiet crying because it's in the Bible. It says, Jesus will help us. Right. That's what I said. I stopped when the Bible came. Oh my God, this case. <laughs> Stop. You make me want one. <laughs> Hello. That is so oh, that nice. That is so fantastic. So cute. It's great that it can do that. Um, you like your makeup? I think my hair looks really pretty. It's wrong on me. It's wrong on you? Mm-hmm. And then with the dress on, with the you whole You didn't like it at dress. first? Yeah. No, I just, but I couldn't tell why. But she did a great job. So yeah. like, the other one, I didn't like it at all. Yeah, like, the, the moment you looked at it, it was like, no. Mm -hmm. uh, you got it? Do anything else? Turn it up. Things or band or something. Hmm. Yeah, let me tell you. They canceled me because I said something about oxygen. It grows on trees. Like, I mean, I grow on trees, but it comes from trees. <laughs> they canceled me last night. So, I'm going into my career. Fine. Okay. 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 Is there anything else you want to say? No. Oh. Oh. Oh, my pleasure. Wow. Where you want to put it? Wherever you think it's. That's fire. Really cute. Is that my phone? That's pretty dope. You should do that like when you go on a date or something. Cause that bun is bunning. That bun is bunning. That bun is bunning. You guys, so right now we're literally just getting glam right now. Just fixing the hair up. Nothing crazy. Actually, come over here. 
This is my sister. The camera will run. Get out the way. Deidre. This is my best friend, Ashley. Yeah. <laughs> here? I thought that's what it is. Or yes, right here? Mm -hmm. Okay. So you should do this style for day night one night. It's good in the camera. Yeah, what's good you Or with yeah. the clip. Like, um, the I'm just sparkly apple cider. Bitch <laughs> all around. <laughs> I can't even say nothing to me. I can't even say nothing to me right now. Like, you know when you talk to each other for the best two days, I can't say I can't find a mean thing to say. Oh my god! Thank you. Oh my god! What they say is give a candy, baby, and I'm gonna be your motivation. That's fun. Cherry does work fantastic. Or I'll be on one here too to keep it flat. Yeah. Okay. How are you hiding them? Um, so instead of just putting it like this flat, I'm pushing it in here to the middle of the clip. Mm-hmm. To have it discreet. Oh, have it discreet. You did that, Brian. She did. I thought you looked so <laughs> Did you want me to fix this one or no? Fix the one that you have put in here. Put that the long bottom pan that's right here. That's sticking out that I hate. Yeah. Okay. Great. Okay. Definitely caught that. Let's see. Girl, you like it? Yes. Great. Thank you. You're welcome. Can you get close? Um, turn. Wait. Look, camera. Turn. 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 Super cute. Okay, next. Ashley. Honor. I'm not sure. I'll switch it. If camera. Get closer. Get closer. Turn. Hair. I like that. I like how you did that little um, mm -hmm. that twist into the. Oh yeah. It's not a That's so pretty, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Uh, so we're going down. You. I love that side. I'm glad we did that. That's so cute. And the next thing you'll see, and she could do it. The next thing you'll see is. Not traditional. It's cold ice water. I respect that. Have you had some? It's fancy. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, Andrea. It was I just I just turned to twist it. Why are you yelling? Oh, I tried to twist it though. I was like, okay, you kinda of embarrassed me. My, my bad. Why loosen it up for you? My bad. Then you yell it. Andrea, I twisted it. What'd you you did for last night? It was like um she like she like took it. Okay, that was crazy. Okay, so I'll just probably turn it on just to do it before. Okay. And then I'll cut it right. Okay. Do I have to look at it? No. Hey guys, Bossy Molly comes on by Miss Monet. You can find her on Instagram at Makeup by Monet. Wait, right? Right? Underscore Makeup by Monet. Underscore Makeup by Monet. She's the colors in the game. Period. <laughs> Dallas, Texas area, Carol, Tip Frisco, right? Everywhere, yeah, Every, everywhere. everywhere. Period. I travel. Period. Fly me out. <laughs> <laughs> she said she was on <laughs> I'm dead serious. What's wrong with your ears? I'm <laughs> about <laughs> to <laughs> run. <laughs> No, you finna be on the same shit list as her. <laughs> <laughs> okay, y'all, this is here. I ain't gonna be in that way. Oh, you okay? No. Oh. She can't see herself, so I'm not gonna flip it up, oh. but <laughs> this is. I'm not slow, Tyra. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. 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 I
Look at him over there doing this. She's enjoying herself. She's having the time of her life. Hey guys, I'm about to get married. I'm so excited. This is my bouquet. I think I look really pretty. See y'all soon.